16th ranked William and Mary hasn't been to the NCAA playoffs in five years. Seven and five didn't cut it last season. So the tribe looking for three more wins to get another shot at the national title with win number six. Well, it could come Saturday in Williamsburg against ninth ranked James Madison. JMU suffering a big loss. Nathan Epstein joins us tonight with that story. That's a big game. We've had some great games with them in the past, and uh, you know they've got a tremendous team this year. The 71 Dukes will bring with them the top offense in all of FCS, an offense that averages over 48 points a game, and likely the fastest unit the tribe will see all season. The number of snaps they get. I mean, that's wow. I mean, to be able to, to get that many snaps in a game, that's 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 impressive. And though they've lost starting quarterback Bad Lee for the rest of the year, nobody is expecting JMU to miss a beat. They just have athletes all around the board. Their, their line is smart. They, they're very good at blocking. Um, and they just make big plays a lot. But the Dukes will be facing one of the best defenses in the country. William & Mary ranks seventh in the nation in total defense and eighth nationally with 11 interceptions. This is why you come to a CAA school is to play, you know, the number one offense um, in the conference. They're always a national powerhouse, so it's always an opportunity for us to go out and improve ourselves. So, you know, it's, it's exciting from that standpoint, absolutely. A chance to keep their conference title and postseason hopes alive. A chance to stay perfect at home all against a rival. We got to protect the black rubber at the Z. That's what we say. Um, it's something about this place that's just really special, and, and we just... We like to think that we can dominate here. Kickoff is 4 o'clock. In Williamsburg, Nathan Epstein for the Sports Rat.